channel. Today I'll be doing a house tour, so follow me. First of all, I just want to say I'm sorry if the audio is not great. I'm filming through my iPhone and I don't have a microphone, um, so you'll hear a lot of echoing, but I apologize for that. Anyways, I am so excited to be showing you guys my home. I know it's one of the most high requested videos. I chose this time to show you guys what it looks like now because Muhammad and I will be um, remodeling I would say like 90% of the house yeah, because I'm not 100% loving the decoration in my house. Um, there are lots of things that Han and I have been planning on changing since we bought this home, but you know, we just take our sweet time with every project. So because we have now decided, okay, this is time, it's time to do all the major changes that we've been talking about for so, so long. Um, that's why I really wanted to get this video done. So you guys get to see a little bit of the before and aftermath. Also, I did do an empty house tour as soon as we bought our home, just in case if you guys want to see more details of the house and how it used to look like versus now because we have done some changes to it. Um, for example, like the crown molding that you see here in the entrance. Oh, give me a second. The crown molding, okay. So all oh, by crown... the way, hi guys. <laughs> by the way, Mohammed is filming, so he will be commentating on the other side and then we'll switch switch roles so he can you know show a little bit and talk cool. about some changes that we'll be doing in the future. Um, but yes, the crown molding is something that I've wanted to do for so long. Um, actually, it's one of the first things that we did as soon as we moved to the house. I really love the details. I mean, the reason why we chose this house is because of the long foyer. Foyer? 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 Americans say foyer, but I think it's foyer. I don't know what we Whatever. Mean, was... The entrance, this beautiful, long, long entrance is really what captivated our attention. Mohammed and I were like, okay, this is enough. I don't even need to see the rooms. I don't need to see the bathrooms. I don't need to see the kitchen. This is the house, uh, subhanAllah, just because of this beautiful, unique um, layout of the house. But yes, this is one of the first things that we did when we moved to the house is the crown molding. Um, which we're planning on actually doing to the top as well. So when you walk into the house, to the right hand side, you will see a bedroom, a bathroom, and another bedroom. So follow me. Okay, so this first bedroom is the guest bedroom. Okay. This is the guest bedroom that Muhammad and I are currently sleeping in. <laughs> I sleep right there. Muhammad Wait, where's sleeps right, right here, there? And she I takes sleep. all the bed. I do not. Hey, look, I'm in, I'm in the mirror over there. Yeah. So Muhammad sleeps on that side. I sleep on this side. So this is the bedroom that Muhammad and I have been sleeping in ever since we moved into the house. Reason why is because we have yet to decide what we want to do to the master bedroom. So for now, the master bedroom is completely empty, and you guys will get to see that in a couple of minutes. But yeah, this is where we're sleeping. This is this, and now we will be moving to the this favorite part of our house. Um, it's not super decorated, it's nothing fancy, but it's the prayer room. We love, love, love this prayer room. It just, it's just so peaceful, it's so quiet, it's just everything. I love having a room that we just dedicate prayers, um, du'as, just, just get away from like the noise and mm -hmm. all, all the fancy stuff and just come here and relax and pray and just be serene. So this is literally my favorite room. As you can see, nothing fancy and that's exactly how I love it, just simple. Um, I, I know we can pray anywhere, you know, outside, inside, any bedrooms, but I just really wanted to dedicate a room for it, especially in Ramadan. This room is just Oh my god, my absolute favorite because when my family come over or friends come over, we all gather in this room and pray tarawih and just it's just amazing. Um, so yeah, let me just give you a little background of these prayer mats. I know they do not match, but they mean so much to me because these three uh, mats, these three prayer mats in silver, the black and white and silver. So these three right here 
We actually purchased them when we made the Amura back in 2019. So they were the first thing that we purchased as soon as we landed in Saudi Arabia. Um, and it just means so much to me that I do not want to get rid of them. And then these two prayer mats that do not match the rest of the prayer mats. As you can see, there's a mini one and a average size one. Um, these two we bought when we were in Palestine, also back in 2019. And I mean, it's just amazing memories. I don't want to get rid of them. I don't want to hide them. I know they don't match. I really don't care. It just brings good vibes, good energy, and just, it makes me happy. But yes, this is one of my absolute favorite, if not my favorite room in the house. Now, backing up, back up, back up. Let me show you now. Um, the guest restroom. It's a nice size um, restroom, I would say. Um, you, we have a shower, the toilet. Shatafa. <laughs> the shatafa is very, very mm. important. Use mm. this to wash our private parts. Essential. Because, um, you know, toilet paper is not cutting it. It's not good enough. Mm. So this is very, very, very important. Um, behind this door, pay attention. Behind this door is another closet. Oh, do you want me to show? Yeah. I don't know what we have in here. Nope, must this is This is actually, this is so dirty. <laughs> this is Muhammad's bathroom, by the way. Oh. So let me tell you, let me share the key to a successful marriage is having two separate bathrooms. Like, just completely. Two separate bathrooms, two separate toilets. We shared Please, a bathroom in the apartment. Oh my God, we shared, a, yeah, we shared a bathroom in the apartment because it was a one bedroom one bathroom two and, bedroom one bathroom oh it was okay it was a two bedroom one bathroom you guys it just it just was no bueno no bueno muhammad would shave his hair would be on the floor that's not fair on the countertop don't tell me that was that, not true. that's not fair you're lying in the bathroom uh, no that's facts and i even made a video showing you guys when he would make wudu Five times a day, by the way, I would be yelling at him. Five yeah. times a day. I'm praying at least. Do water on the mirror, water on the countertop, water on the floor. I'm like, yo, pick after yourself. So it was very important for us to have our own bathrooms when we moved into this home. Please, you know I'm telling you. Get, it, get out of get out of my bathroom. Get out of my bathroom. Get out of my bathroom. Guys, I mean, get out. <laughs> Honestly, guys, I don't believe her. Um, okay, like any the water, she she's not lying, but I'm not that bad. She's just, all right, maybe I am. Whatever. <laughs> okay, guys. So now moving on to the midsection of the house. Um, to my right hand side, you will see another storage, and right over here we have. The laundry, which I'm not going to show you. What? Okay. It's a bit messy. Here, I show it? no, really just messy. open the turn. Turn the lights on. That's it. Watch out. So pretty much as you see right here, that's a washer. That's the dryer. We have some cabinets on top that we put like the detergent and all that stuff. Yeah. And that's pretty much and it. And then we also have another um, door that leads to the master closet. But I'll show you that when another we way. get to the master closet. Um, but yeah, what you didn't see is a pile of dirty clothes in the corner. But you, you get the I But get. you get the point. And right over here, we have the owner's entry. Um, this actually came standard with the home that we bought, with the house. Um, and these were actually the two colors that um, our kitchen and our bathrooms would have been had we not upgraded. But because we wanted a completely different look, we just decided to um, upgrade every other room except for the entry, the owner's entry, because no one really gets to see this. And if we opted out of like not um, wanting this, we would have just had an empty um, space over here, which I wouldn't have known what to do with it. So I said, yeah, sure, just add the cabinets and add the countertops that comes already with the house. Um, right here we have the garage. Yes. So this room to my left is Muhammad's room or like the chill room. Um, usually when Muhammad's friends come over and they want to chill, they come to this room. So for now, it's very basic. We don't have much going on. Um, this rug that we got from Walmart, 
And it's the, nice. Actually, I love, I love, love, love the sofa. It's deep. Wait, okay, I see now. Yeah. So freaking comfortable. If Muhammad is looking for me, he knows to come here because this is probably the coziest couch you'll ever sit on. It's That's true. so, so freaking comfortable. I fit in it. It's so easy to fall asleep in here. It's dangerous. Yeah. Um, but yeah, we got this couch from where? I think it was... Um, American Signature. American Signature, yeah. This, uh, this is actually where we come and do some editing work. We don't have a chair for it, so we usually grab any chair from the dining room and bring it over here and do some work. But we have yet to figure out what we really want to do with this area as far as decorating it. Um, I think eventually we're gonna we're going to get rid of this, the the tiny rug, and then do something to this wall over here that's a bit untouched. And I don't want you guys to see it because it's very very hideous. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So now follow me. Okay. To my uh -oh. working space. So you probably oh. have seen this room more than you have seen the entire house because this is the room where. I do most of my videos, my reels, my TikToks, um, getting ready, my YouTube, everything you have seen on my Instagram and every other social media platform. I would say 90% of the time I am in this room. Come in. Ooh. Okay, so my most asked question about this room is the closet. And if this is all of the clothes that I own, now that would be ridiculous because you guys see me wear literally every color in the rainbow and <laughs> every color in the rainbow is not up here. No, it doesn't so, look like Skittles. <laughs> I like to keep the space pretty neutral. Um, yeah. it's, it's just more it's, to Yeah, my eyes. it's like also like when you do videos, right? You don't want too many colors to be all over the place in the video. You, you have a specific theme you want to stick to with your YouTube yeah. video. So I get it. Yeah. The closet is where you have multiple colors here. It's just a lighter theme, so on the camera, it's, it yeah. gives it a lighter background. And I don't know if you guys noticed, but depending on the season, I like to switch up my clothes. So with spring coming, I will add some pink and some green and some mm. yellow. Um, so depending on the season, of every season, I like to you know, change my clothes. But yeah, I have some of my boots, some of my shoes and bags. I don't have everything I own right here. It's just, I, I change it, I always change it. We have another clothing rack. This is super old. I've had this since the apartment. Um, and when I say the apartment, we are going back like, I don't know, six, seven years. Right, Mel? Yeah. You're waving at yourself? <laughs> yeah. I'm not showing up. You yeah, I would say like years. around that time. Yeah. I think we moved out like in two, uh, yeah. Like yeah, so four basically, years ago. I kept a lot of my furniture and just most used like items or pieces from the apartment. I brought it to this house. Okay, so on this side of the room, I have my lights and I have my camera, I have my tripod. This stays in the corner at all time. Um, but yeah, so yeah, now come on. Do you want to show the rest of the house? Yeah, why not? Why not? All right guys, so you got the switch. Big Mo here to show you the rest of the house. If you follow me. Yes. This is the kitchen, right? So pretty much this right here, we got a quartz uh, countertop for the kitchen. We did it through the builder. Um, as you see here, this thing is called the waterfall. We did the waterfall and we loved how it looked. It stands out in the kitchen a lot. And then here is the pantry. I'm not gonna Whoop. open it because Whoop. it's messy. Close that but, thing. <laughs> but if you wanna see how it looks, Omaya did an empty house tour before. So you yeah. can go back to that video and look at how it looks. Yeah. Uh, microwave, oven. As you can see throughout our kitchen. Oh, and also a little coffee station. Oh, a little coffee station right here. We got the little cups up there. Yeah. But the biggest thing here, as you can see, we don't have a lot of appliances out. We just pretty much have like a juicer and the ninja. We just like, don't like to have a lot of cluttering going on in the kitchen. We put everything away. And then whenever we want to use it, we go ahead and Yeah, use but it. we have literally a toaster and a presser and oh, everything, everything you can think of but we just don't like a cluttered kitchen. And yeah. this has pretty much stayed like this for almost three years that we've lived, lived in this house. Exactly. So this is just what makes us happy. It's, it's nice. Okay. And then right here, we got the stove. Yeah. Some more places here where we can store some things. So um, we upgraded on the color of the cabinets, the size yes. of the cabinets and um, 
the hood. The hood. That didn't come with the standard kitchen. All right, now moving to, on. To, to a very small dining area. So, yeah. So, okay. Let me sit down and tell you guys. So, <laughs> so pretty much in our um, home style, we chose this because, like when I told you, we love the hallway. We love that foyer walkway. But it takes a little bit away from the dining area and the kitchen. So, as you can see, our dining area is a little bit smaller. But we also have a big dining it's table. It's a pretty big table. Yeah, yeah six chairs. Six chairs. We had this from the apartment days. Mm -hmm. So what we're trying to do, like Omari was saying, we're trying to change up some things. We'll probably modernize this a little bit and get a smaller dining table. Mm -hmm. um, so we can optimize the space. So we can take more of the space, yes, and also sit less people. Yeah. But the good thing about this is we have some stools. So you can pretty much sit all around as well as the dining table. Yeah. So that's something that we're looking to try to do so we can, you know, optimize the space. Like yeah, outside. we're definitely getting rid of the, the dining table. Yes, yes. it's uh -huh. too big. Um, it's nice. This area right here is where Omai and I spend most of our time. Yes. Where we plan stuff out, where we talk, where we just chill. Where we do videos. Where we do videos. And this stuff right here is all added by us. Um, whenever we first moved into the home, like you've seen on Omai's old video, this was just a wall. A so white wall. A white wall, nothing mm -hmm. to it. We didn't really like the feel. It didn't feel, you know, we there was no vibe, right? Yes. So what uh, Omaya was like, I, I have this idea from a model home, this and that, my bro. So can we talk about what we would do <laughs> in our <Yeah>. free time? <laughs> so literally after we closed on the home, we always... A little bit be before the home, though. Before, before we home, bought the house. after the home. Yeah. We always used to go around to model homes. So we used to drive around to the uh, near communities next to us yeah. and check out model homes. And Omai would literally take pictures and like be like, oh, I want to try this or I want to try this. And most of the stuff that we got in our mind is from Omai's pictures from these model homes. Yeah. So this right here was something that she was inspired with. Initially, we were thinking about doing like a little fireplace and then, you yeah. know, having cabinets on the side. But then Muhammad had a good point. He said, you know, when I look at the TV, I just want to focus on the TV. Yeah. I don't want to have side distractions. I don't want to see decorations. I don't want you to decorate like around the countertop. Just leave it as it is. It's yeah. just clean. It's just super sleek. And um, that that's a good point that he had. So we just kept it like this. Yeah. The brick walls. Um, we have, I think this is granite. Yeah, I think it's granite too. This is, we, and then we, we did the cabinets with, um, a company and mm -hmm. we added the, the Chrome hardware from Amazon. Yes. So yeah, like Omaya said, the other change we're looking to do is the couches. Yes. <laughs> the couches with this coffee table. Pretty sure probably the carpet is going to go too, depending on what new couches we're going to go with. But as you see here, this is what we had in our apartment. Yeah. We bought the couches, the coffee table, the dining table. It all, all as a set. It all matches. It, 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 in the apartment, it was a little bit more of a vibe there. Yeah, it was the more carpet, cozy. It was cozy. And we're going to be looking at different options to try and show a lot to change this stuff soon. Yeah. And, and by the way, I'm sorry you're seeing shadows. Uh, it's getting a little bit dark outside. Yeah. So we're using some lights to show you everything. So yeah. here, as uh, you can see, this is the gallery wall. Omai and I picked our favorite images from the places uh, we've traveled, also memories that we had here at home, mm -hmm. and put them on the wall. So, just what is your favorite one? Um, What's your favorite picture? The the two for sure is you know at Mecca, yes, um, as well as in Palestine. Like Aww. those are two of like you know we're just very memorable. It's actually the same trip, yeah, but it was just very very memorable to us and to me, and um, you know that's why I just stick out. Now, to give you a quick little run now, though. Okay, let's start from the top. Start from the top. Okay. Here is uh, us in Philistine. Yes. And then here is us graduating. Yes, university, we graduated from USF 2014. University of South Florida. Here, back at home, Egypt. Egypt. Took Omaya there for the first time. Yes. Right here is Japan. And I would love to go back and show Yes, I love Japan. Our wedding day is this Aww. picture right here. Here, him was looking fly. <laughs> okay. <laughs> This was in Rome, um, Italy. Italy. Here was in Dubai, another amazing place. Yes. Saudi doing Umrah. The best, best time of our life. amazing, blessed time. 
and Switzerland. I believe this was our last trip. Last trip. Last international trip. Yeah. And 2019. Yeah. International trip. Our last international yeah, trip. Yeah, definitely our last trip. Right one. after that, the world changed. Shut yep. Yes, a shutdown, yep. unfortunately. Cool. Now you got the kitchen and the living room. Follow me inside the master bedroom. I'll show you how big our bed is. <laughs> As you can Woo! see, we all have a bed here. This is our master bedroom, <laughs> but uh, we're using it as like So a, big, what a big bed. <laughs> we're using it as a mini storage area for oh now. Oh my God. Omaya and I have- you, Wait, a, what did you say? We're using it as a mini storage? <laughs> we're using this as a mini storage area right now. Kind of like a big closet. Yes, um, we just have more clothes and more packages. My literally just PR got packages. packages. Um, and, uh, and honestly, here's the thing, right? We are not in a rush. Yeah. It's only Omaya and I. We are comfortable in the other room. Yes. So we want to have a good, good design here. Yes. We want to decorate it and, and take our time with it. So inshallah, we're going to do this soon. Another major reason why we haven't done anything in this room yet is for the carpet. Yeah. We actually weren't a fan of this type of carpet, uh, of carpet. this type of carpet <laughs> in the master bedroom. Yes. So we have an idea in our mind that we're trying to do regarding the floor. And inshallah, after that's done, we can go ahead and uh, make this Plan for room. the rest of the room, yeah. Right now we're entering the master bathroom. Yes. Follow me. Here is the toilet. My toilet. Her toilet. I'm not going to show you guys because she's very dirty. <laughs> Whatever, I am so clean. Sure. And then, <laughs> as you can see here, we got a his and hers sink. Sink. Um, you know, this is where we keep our toothbrushes, our cologne, perfume, deodorant, all that stuff. Use some of these uh, cabins for cabinets. Cabinets. <laughs> cabinets. We use some of these cabinets <laughs> for storage and you know, bathroom stuff. Yes. This right here is my closet. This is um, out of the whole house. When I was like, you should have this in the closet. <laughs> I mean, she wanted everything else. She wanted a whole room as a closet. I don't even have a light, as you can see. This is where I keep my hoodies, my shirts. I have two scales for some reason. I'm not even, I'm not even losing you, weight. You bought these scales. I don't know why they're in here. I have two scales and they ain't helping me at all. Uh, I have a small other closet that I use that for. Yeah. Uh, this is where, you know, my everyday stuff. Yes. Listen, it was your idea. You my said idea you can have what? both closets. Mm, I did, didn't I? Yeah, it came out of your mouth. I did not have to ask you for both, but clearly you knew that I needed it more than you. Yeah, we don't need to argue in the bathroom. Okay. okay. Here is a. a What's up with you in bathrooms? I'm in the bathroom. <laughs> You're like, we can't do this in the bathroom. We can't do this in the bathroom. <laughs> this is a his and hers towel. <laughs> different colors. Okay, and then of course, this is the shower. I'm not going to yeah. open it for you guys. You don't really need to see it. Yeah. Now, this is one of the last projects we just finished. Mm -hmm. Let me show you. Oh, it's for Omaya. <laughs> Here, as you can see, this is Omaya's uh, third, no, second closet. Yes. Um, the smaller one. Remember a little bit ago, she doesn't like to put the Skittle colors in her um, YouTube room. <laughs> so this is where she puts the Starburst, Skittles, Rainbow colors, everything here. Uh, you're funny. Um, I'll try to be. <laughs> as you can see here, she's, she color coordinates it, blue. It just makes it easier for me to find all my clothes. Exactly. What I'm but looking for. Exactly, but our family friend helped us with this project. Omaya had an idea to put shelves and to at the poles, at the poles right here. The gold and, um, poles. It came out looking nice. She definitely can't do this part without me, so I'm always trying <laughs> to help her out. But I'm, we did a YouTube video. If you guys want to see the before and after, yeah. we did a YouTube video of how we made this closet or how the idea came about. Yep. Here's the thing. Let me be honest with you guys. Um, if you have a wife mm -hmm. that is into fashion is into taking pictures and all this stuff, she's gonna need two closets, right? <laughs> that's just how it is. I understand that and uh, I'm good with it. I so that's why you. I gave her the two big closets and I'm satisfied with my little side closet. I love it. And the guest room closet. Oh my now God. here's the issue. Yeah. What if we do have guests? Do I go in there when they're sleeping <laughs> and get my stuff? No, so we're gonna have to figure that out because I can't just be walking in hey, my bed. I'm, just, I'm going to play basketball. I'm going to the shit. No, like, they don't worry like that. So when we get to that level, yeah, we'll, figure, we'll it figure it out. Maybe I'll be moved in the prayer room or something. <laughs> so uh, we'll figure that out when we get there. Um, and then I guess one more spot yeah. is her other closet. <laughs> that one, you'll guys... I'm not going to show fully. You guys will see... Um, yeah, here we go. 
But as you can see here, uh, I mean, I can explain to Ramai, you can explain this is where her other clothes are. Um, definitely clothes that she's ready to go to a blizzard in. As you can see, it's very heavy. Still you don't know where in Florida else. she's going to wear this. Dresses for weddings that we go to every other weekend. Um, and then I don't want to show you behind me, it's a little bit messy, but some other stuff. But yeah, like seriously, she looks like she could just wear this. <laughs> with a pair of Tim's and uh, <laughs> go to New York or something. I don't know. I mean, well, I, I needed a closet to put my coats just, you know, you just in it. case when we go on vacation, I don't need to buy more coats. I already have a whole bunch, right? Yes, you do. And then on this side, I have all of my dresses. So these are casual dresses, um, fancy dresses. I have my henna dress. I also have my second wedding dress hold up i had two wedding you dresses have memories where my clothes look at that. can be <laughs> you have memories um where my just can be. a whole bunch of like dresses and abayas all the way at the back yeah so again this is not like one of those urgent uh projects that we're gonna do but eventually we definitely want to do um what we the did updated that shelves for her yeah in here so she can have more space and uh, it, it would definitely... And also for my shoes. I don't really have an area where I put have, my shoes. We both don't have an area for shoes. Our shoes so, kind of are scattered a little bit. That's, that's something we house. need to figure yeah. out. The problem is, too, with my shoes, they don't fit in specific shelves. So I need to You need a, a customized... Yeah, we're going to customize me. your closet. Yeah. <laughs> no, we're definitely. We're going to customize your closet because we do need to figure out a, like, a decent shoe space for your shoes because you're a size... 16. 16 16 so yeah our shelves are standard and his 16 size shoe is always falling when we place them on the shelf so or the, or the door doesn't close or the door doesn't close which yeah that's the case okay. for us so we have to do some sort of customization to excited your for shoe. my closet <laughs> your shoe closet all right guys so that is all for the house tour yep. i hope you guys enjoyed it um, we definitely were a little nervous about filming it because um, initially we're like, okay, but this is not exactly how we would like our house tour to go because yep. we're not happy with the furniture and the decoration, but... Because we're still not done with We're not done with it. We already touched a little bit on how we're going to change most of the decoration in the house. Mm -hmm. um, in the beginning of the video, I told you guys we're going to make some major changes. So um, I don't want to speak about it. I don't want to jinx it before it actually happens, yeah. but we, we're we pretty much going to do- Inshallah, we're gonna do a lot of changes change. throughout the house. In yeah, like you, you'll you say, oh, it looks like a different house. Yeah. Inshallah. Inshallah. So, so we're gonna do our best to get that going. Inshallah before Ramadan, so we can have a good Ramadan vibe in our yeah, home. Yeah, and so the reason why we wanted to do this is just to show you guys the before and after. Yep. Um, but yeah, we're very excited, inshallah, yep. for the and next I'm... couple of weeks. And of course, I'll update you guys along the way. I'll do vlogs of mm -hmm. our decision-making process, yep. um, of like just behind the scene, why we chose to go with a different route mm -hmm. and why we chose specific colors. Yep. Um, also, but, furniture shopping. Yes, What furniture options shopping. we're looking at. Yeah. Uh, I think what Amaya's gonna do, she's gonna keep filming clips mm -hmm. until it's the day to do the stuff, and uh, she's and just gonna put it out. Just, yeah, show it to you guys, and then do a really cool house tour, inshallah, inshallah. inshallah. Also, we have changed our uploading days to YouTube. Yep. So instead of Fridays, it will be Saturdays, just because it works so much better for our schedule. It does. So just expect new videos moving forward on Saturdays. Inshallah. Also, if you haven't subscribed already, please do so. Yes. So you'll be notified every single time we upload a video to our channel. Yep. We really love if you guys could be a part of our family, especially on YouTube, Instagram, and TikTok. Yeah. Um, you know, Omai and I love to post daily on Instagram and TikTok. And if you have any video ideas, for YouTube. Please put them in the comments below. Yeah. We're open to anything and we're always excited to do challenges or as you can see, house tours. So yes. let us know. Yes, thank you guys so much for watching and we'll see you next week. Salam everybody. Salam. Have a nice weekend.